this, 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 this. Look, I'm done. Yes? I'm done. You're done. Excellent. Fantastic work. Woohoo! You wanna go see? Only took you, what, three months? It, it's beautiful, okay? I'm teasing, I'm teasing. Maybe oh. finally now we can start attracting clients in this godforsaken wilderness. If there's anybody even around, let alone anyone who might want our services. Our services are great. I'm sure they'll come flocking. Anyways, let's go see it. Okay then. Lead on. Okay. You are aware the door is that way. Uh, not the sneaky door. Really? Must There's... we do this every time? But we have a secret passage. Why would we not use it? Very well. Death drop! <laughs> you are entirely too fond of that thing. It's great! I don't know why you dislike it so much. Ugh. Ah, oh, that is still distinctly unpleasant. It's great fun. I mean, look! Oh my! Well, wow, this is certainly quite a change since last time. Yeah, I remodeled the hallway, and I came and did all this. Good, we have like display cabinets for our collars and our paddles and our other things. <laughs> it's beautiful, my dear. Fantastic. Yay. Although, I must say the skulls are a tad tacky. We may have to replace them. But they're so cool. I why why something a little more tasteful in gold or silver, perhaps. I think the skulls are a wonderful decoration. I don't know what you mean. We're not a mausoleum. They hardly set the mood. I don't know. I think they do. Anyways, is this all there is to it? Uh, no. I mean, we have these beautiful sofas and our table. We've got some chains over here, which are pretty cool. And our wardrobe, Lovely. full of fun things. Oh, nice. Well, you've done a fine job. Oh, thanks. And what are these? Um, surprises. No. Really? It's it's a complete surprise. Well, there's no time like the present for it no. to be a surprise. No, we should definitely, definitely wait for that surprise. It's like opening Christmas presents early. You don't want to do that. You haven't finished them, have you? I mostly finished them, sort of. So, when you say that you've finished the den, what you really mean is you've completed one room. Uh, I put doors on the other ones. That's Oh dear. That's like finishing it, right? If you can't see no. the inside, it's, it's finished. No, that's nothing like finishing it at all. I have no idea what you mean. We can't open with half the rooms unfinished. Sure we can. We have a lovely plush rug and sofas for entertaining guests. What about a bed? Uh, uh, is that the doorbell? We have a doorbell? Yeah, I installed one. You... You installed a doorbell? And didn't bother to finish any of the rooms. I was busy. I do have to question your priorities sometimes. I really do. Look, what were you doing the whole three months that I was working my butt off, okay? This is going to hurt, isn't it? Here goes. That doesn't seem so bad. Ow! Ah! Ow! Ow! Ah. 
important vampire things you wouldn't understand. Aha. Uh-huh. Well, you certainly weren't helping. I understand that well enough. Oh, hello. And who might you be? You may call me Linelli. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Lucrezia and this is Beatrice. Hi, I'm B. Call me B. Understood. I noticed some new residents in this house. I thought it appropriate to come by and introduce myself. Yes, it's lovely to meet you. We've uh, not had many visitors so far. I suppose we're a little out of the way, but... Uh... I was wondering uh, how you came into this house. It's such a lonely place. Oh, I've owned this house for quite some time now. Just I've never felt the need to live in it. I see. Are you planning to live here permanently? Oh, for, for now, I think so, yes. It's uh, been quite a nice change of pace living out in the countryside. Yeah. Albeit a tad, a tad lonely. No, I mean, it's a lot nicer than the pitchforks and the mobs. B? Yeah? We've discussed this. They don't need to know about that. I only ask because I was acquainted with the previous owners. Oh, really? You knew my sire? Mm, a sire? I don't think so. It must have been the people before that. The original owners of the house? Yes. If you don't mind me asking, how old are you exactly? Oh, uh, that's a complicated question. I think I stopped counting a few dozen centuries ago. Centuries? Uh, yes. It's been quite a while. I don't suppose that would make you a fellow vampire by any chance? Uh, no. I happen to enjoy the sunlight in certain settings. A werewolf, then? Possibly? No. Well, you're not human. Humans don't live for several centuries. If you must know, I am a fae. (gasps) Do you have wings? Oh. I do have wings. Can I see them? B. Well... What? What? Where are your manners? I'm being friendly. Stop harassing the guest. (sighs) Sorry. I don't mind being friendly. Apologies for her. She has no manners and was probably born in a barn. I... Uh, Actually, I I have no idea. So, uh, maybe. Well... If you would like to get to know each other better, I think it might be a good idea to have a little get-together, maybe have some tea. Ooh, that sounds nice. Do you have sweets? That's very kind of you, but I'm afraid we simply couldn't. We're very, very busy with the house, having only just moved in. You know how it is. I just finished the basement. You didn't finish it. I mostly finished it. That's not the same as finished. It... Mostly. It's totally the same. Finished is in the phrase. But, anyways, I'm afraid we'll have to decline. Hmm. Such a shame. Well, the invitation is open, if you would like to visit me sometime. That's very kind of you. Well, I ought to be going. As you say, you have work to do, and I'm sure I have a few things to set up, so... I'll be seeing you around. Yeah, totally. Oh, I'm sure you will. Well, goodbye. Have a nice evening. Bye. Farewell, Lanelli. Well, you were uncharacteristically rude to someone who wasn't me. And you were uncharacteristically friendly. I'm just trying to do what you told me to do. Be friendly. Don't punch people. I did not tell you to rub your face all over our guests. I was not rubbing my face all over them. I just wanted to see their wings. Well, either way, you were entirely inappropriate inappropriate and and way too handsy. I don't see what the problem is. Honestly, it's the first person we've seen in ages. We should be really friendly to them. They're a fae. So? So, they're untrustworthy, and slippery, and probably have some kind of ulterior motive. I think you're just overthinking things. 
I've dealt with the Fae before. They're rarely friendly for the sake of being kind. Look, Gwenelle seemed perfectly nice. I don't know why we had to turn down her tea invite. Hmm. I just don't think it's wise to be accepting things from Fae before we get to know them properly. <sighs> and, well, I didn't technically lie. You still have work to do around the house. I don't those wanna. Uh, I spent three months on those. I don't care if you don't wanna. Those rooms need finishing. This is our business we're talking about here. <sighs> so much work. You accepted a project, now see it through. I, you forced me to take that project. The point stands, the rooms need finishing. Can I get my friend to come help? Your friend? Yeah. Where exactly did you meet this friend? Uh, when I was at the Merc camp? Oh. Yes, I'd forgotten about that. Is yeah. he a fae? No, no. And he's big and strong. I'm sure he could lift lots of things. Like me. <laughs> Very well, then. I suppose it couldn't hurt. If it means the room's good. Oh! Yay! I'll write him a letter! Er, well, you'll write him a letter. I still can't write. Not for lack of trying. I have been attempting to teach you. Well, you're boring. 